Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com, and I was asked recently if we could explain how to create safe mode desktop shortcuts. Yes, we can. Here is the VBS files you're going to need. So check the video description. I'll give you a link right at the top, right to go right to this. Click download now. Your download will start within a few seconds. Inside the zip is a link to this tutorial. You probably won't need it. So here's what you're going to have right here. Let's double click it. Those of you who have WinZip or PZip, you know what to do. Everybody else, click Extract, Extract All. Very important we put it into C. Well, not really very important. Depends on your skill level. You can put it anywhere you want. Select the folder, and that will create the Safe Mode folder, as you can see right here. This is going to have to stay here. If you get in trouble, note there's a tutorial link here that will open that page. All right, let's do this. So, speaking of that page, I'm going to refer to it. There's four files you can create, safe mode, command prompt, networking, and normal. I recommend everybody make normal, so let's do that. Well, we'll do that afterwards. Let's do safe mode with networking. So, all you need to know is these four codes right here. Here is safe mode with networking, and we're going to head over to our desktop now. And we're going to right click and we're going to do new and we're going to do shortcut. Control V, unless you feel like typing, paste that in. Click next. And we're going to want to name this, let's say, safe mode with networking. How's that? You can name it anything you like. There it is. So, the other thing I wanted to mention everybody should make is the ability to come back into normal mode. So let's do that real quick. New. Shortcut. Control V. Next. Name it anything you want. It looks good for you. Click Enter or click Finish. Now we've got both. All you got to do now is double click this and it will reboot into safe mode. And it'll take just a second here. And then when you're done, of course, I pointed out that you can just double click to reboot into normal mode and you're all set. So we're doing safe mode with networking, one of my favorites that I often use when I boot into safe mode that allows you to have internet access if you're troubleshooting problems. And there you go, as you can see, we are in, get out of here, get out of here. There we go, we are in safe mode. Doo -doo -doo. Do your thing, reboot into normal mode. Now, once that's finished again, we'll show you another thing or two you might want to consider because now that you have them on your desktop, I know some of you like to have lots and lots of stuff on your desktop. I like a nice clean desktop. So we can always create shortcuts. We can drag it over to the taskbar. So let's say safe mode with networking. You could pin it to your taskbar. You can always right click to remove it by unpinning. You could pin it to start, which would be a good place to put it. Show me start. There you go. Move it around, put it wherever you want it. And the same with this. You could do it here so you have your two favorites, just as an example, of course. No, I'm going to do the wrong one. Pin to start. Come on, show me. There you go. And you can keep them right next to each other, for example. So there you go. You can just come in any time and bada bing, bada boom. So hey, bottom right corner, little Major Geeks logo. Click on that. You can subscribe. We always appreciate that. Thanks for watching. As always, see ya.